Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you saw in the title of the video, I'm right now in my hometown, Lima, Peru. We're very excited to be here. We're here for part of the summer vacation, even though it's winter here, still lovely. We are spending time with my family and friends. So yeah, we're very excited. And I'm going to show you all the things we're going to do here so you can see a little more of my hometown. It's beautiful, so I hope you like it too. Right now it's around 7 p.m. Uh, we're going out with my aunt and Olivia. We want to see, there is a street called Pizza Street, <laughs> Calle de las Pizzas, that is all light up right now. It completely changed from the last time I came, so I want to check it out and I'm going to take you with me. So it's the next day, we are relaxing here today, we have some plans for later, but I wanted to talk to you about Dossier, they are partnering with me in this part of the video, and probably some of you may know that I've been using their perfumes for a while now and I absolutely love them, because they reproduce classic high-end luxury scents at a fraction of the price, keeping the exact same high quality by cutting all the expenses and the infamous brand tax. I love that they are very affordable. The prices are between $29 and $59, while you can find designer scents up to $280 in retail and usually for smaller quantities. So yes, I think this is an amazing concept. You can get your favorite scents at a fraction of the price and with the same high quality. So I think it's great. And now I'm going to show you the two scents they kindly sent me. They all come in this box like this and with this card with all the information I'm going to do a close-up so you can see it well you can find here the notes it has inspired by the designer scent concentration and everything all the information is here and first is the floral aldehyde which reproduces the Chanel number no. five my mom's favorite so this is very special to me and I cannot wait to try it I want to try it right now my arm it smells so good my mom used this perfume for years she loved it. it reminds me of her a lot very very similar love it I'm going to do a close-up too so you can see it well and the next one is the amber cherry which reproduces the Tom Ford lost cherry and this one has top notes cherry, almond, cinnamon, middle notes, cloves, rose, jasmine, plum, and base notes, Peru balsam, tonka bean, and vanilla. So I'm going to try it on my other arm. Very strong. I like it. Love it. Really good. And if you decide to return the scent, they offer a standard 30 days return period in which customers can return any unsealed 50 ml dossier perfume and get a full refund, no questions asked. And they are always adding new scents to their collections, so they are open to suggestions from customers for future releases. And they donate all return perfume bottles to a charity association as they are trying to not use plastic anymore. And all their perfumes are vegan and cruelty free they are never tested on animals, which is amazing. And Dossier has a welcome offer up to 20% off on the website 
and you can get up to 30% off your first order by using the discount code that is going to be down below in the description. The extra 10% applies at checkout on top of the welcome offer. And OCA has a new payment method that lets you earn store credit. Select Catch at the last step of checkout and you earn $10 sign-on bonus credit. So yes, as I said, I think this is a very interesting concept. You can get your favorite scents at a fraction of the price with the same high quality. So yes, the link is going to be down below in the description along with the discount code. You have to try it. I'm sure you're going to love them. So thank you again, Dossier, for partnering with me in this part of the video. Hello, so we are about to leave now. Cliff is watching some videos. We're going to meet one of my very good childhood friends today. It's a very cold day again. But first, we're going to stop and a store to look from some t-shirts. As you know, soccer is huge in Peru, many countries in Latin America. And tomorrow, Peru is playing against Australia looking to classify for the World Cup that is going to be in Qatar in November. So hopefully we will win tomorrow. So we're going to look for some t-shirts with Peru on it, red or white. We'll see what we can find to wear tomorrow. It's going to be like a huge party. The whole country is going to stop tomorrow for the game. So yeah, and then we're going to meet my friend and we're, we're going to we're going to hang out for a bit. I'm going to take you to. Are you ready? Yes. Go. So let's go. Let's go. tu muñequita <laughs> so it's the next day it's game day we bought the shirts at the market yeah because they're cool and they're wet with white. Yeah, super cute. They are playing right now. It's nerve wracking. Hopefully, Peru yeah. wins. Right now, everyone is like glued to the screen. They put big screens on parks and around Lima, around Peru. Everyone is like watching the game. Everything is stopped. So if we win, we will go outside to see all the people celebrating. So hopefully, we will win today. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. So it's a couple of days later. Unfortunately, Peru lost the game. We didn't classify to the World Cup. So that's why I stopped filming. We were all <laughs> very sad. But anyways, today I'm very excited because we are going to my favorite mall here. It has an ocean view, it's beautiful. I'm going to take you there. We're going to hang out there for a bit with Olivia. I'm sure it's going to be super fun. I'm going to show you when we get there.
has the best views. Love this. Well, we're going to walk around to see, to have a better view of the ocean until we get to a cafe that I also love. It has a beautiful view. This is what I miss the most of my hometown. Like being so close to the ocean with these amazing views. All the gardens and the flowers is precious. Yeah, I come here as much as I can. Every time I come here, I have to. We're going to have a lot of fun. Yeah, let's go. We are stopping for a bit because we're tired of walking. Yeah, because we're waiting for Papa Toyo. We're waiting for my dad. He walks so slow, so we're waiting for him. And Olive is hungry, so we are still wearing masks. It's mandatory here. Still only indoors, I think. But yeah. All these days were really very gloomy days, but finally today there was a little bit of sunshine, so I said no, we have to take advantage of that and come here. So yeah, we wait a little bit, a little bit more, and then we continue. And we made it it's right there. Finally, let's go. Well, we are home now, finally. We have a great time, it was very nice. The weather was great, actually it wasn't that cold, so it was perfect. And the view, of course, beautiful. So yes, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. Let me know in the comments what do you think of Lima, if you like Peru, if you like this very beautiful city, let me know in the comments. Probably I'll do one more vlog showing you the things we are doing here before we get back to the US. So yes, I hope you like this video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.